Another critical operation for troops is intelligence gathering through surveillance missions, but flying over enemy territory is extremely dangerous. A recent DARPA breakthrough, the A-160, can conduct surveillance at high altitude over long distances without placing a human life at risk. The A-160 does not have a, a pilot in the traditional sense. Um, the people in the ground control station, including myself, have control over the bird through a data link where we give it airspeed, uh, heading, uh, velocity commands. The pilotless A-160 can hover at 20,000 feet and has set a world record for a helicopter of its size, flying 18.7 hours without refueling. A160 is, uh, is clearly a game changer. Its ability to take off and land vertically and its very, very long endurance and its high altitude operation gathers together uh, a set of capabilities uh, that no other aircraft has ever had before. Today, at a secure landing field in Victorville, California, the A160 will be tested carrying a payload that is itself a breakthrough, a radar system called Forrester. The Forrester's most impressive capability is the ability to see through a number of layers of tree foliage. Single double canopy, we'll go through that like a hot knife through butter. So any place where people can hide in foliage, we can find it. Today's flight test will assess whether the A160 can safely rotate the massive Forrester antenna. Can the A160 deploy the antenna for radar detection at various angles without endangering its stability in flight? The aircraft is towed into position. The technicians await the takeoff command. Shadowed by a chase helicopter, the A-160 carrying the Forrester antenna climbs to its programmed altitude for the test to begin. Altitude, 5,000 feet. Can the pilotless aircraft remain stable as it deploys the radar antenna for the first time subjecting the aircraft to maximum torque? It's time to find out. The radar antenna is deployed. The test director delivers the official verdict. The antenna was rotated a full plus minus 180 degrees, and we flew with the antenna out at 90 degrees as well. So uh, a lot of good data was captured. Today's flight completed a lot of the unknown territory and questions we had with the antenna installed on the A160. We're very, very pleased with the performance. The flight test determined that the A160 could safely deploy the Forrester antenna at any angle without endangering the aircraft's stability. The A160 can be operated in fully autonomous mode where we give it a mission plan and then it goes through and executes those commands with no input from the operator. Capable of flying complex missions without a pilot, the A160 can carry a thousand pound payload, weapons, supplies, and more. It has the potential to go in and perhaps rescue somebody from a situation that you wouldn't be able to get a person out of otherwise. The aircraft could fly it autonomously, perhaps get that person out and bring them back to safety. No matter how complex the technology, the A160, like many DARPA innovations, has a simple goal, to save lives. For 50 years, no idea has been dismissed as impossible if it could protect America's warfighters and keep surprise on our side. And the next